Hello there, guys, and welcome back to Rada Kuzanoa. This is the 20th session of this fantastic, beautiful, sexy game. We are on chapter 5, the day of misfortune. This chapter, if I remember correctly, is where everything just goes to shit. Just awful shit. However, we do get a few places of uh, Tokyo open up to us when we're doing this chapter. So, let's give her a whirl. We have to talk to these bastards here, these guys. Mm, something you need, son? It's the directions you're after. I'm a little bit busy at the moment. Or, excuse me, didn't Detective Kazama mention us to you? Yes, just to help. Uh, why do I have such trouble saying Kazama? Because, I, I, I don't know. I have to say it slowly or else it doesn't come out right. Kazama, blah, blah, blah. Damn that Kazama. Looks like he forgot to mention us to this bull. I doubt we'll be able to get anything out of this guy. Let's move on for now. Okay. Let's go talk to some other bastards in white. Hey, look, there's a bastard in white. Yo, Brown, what's good? Detective Kazama told me about you. are assisting us with the case, right? What's this case you're talking about? Detective Kazama didn't fill you in. Excuse me while I get myself comfortable in a position to both talk and play this game. Alright, we're investigating what looks like a serial killing. It's happening all over the capital. Yep, here's where the shit starts hitting the fan. Yep. All we've got to go on are these strange wood fragments left behind at every scene. Wood fragments. That's what I said. I've got one on alone from the lab boys. If you want to look at it. What the fuck? Rado, isn't that? Yep, it's the insect cage. Mind if I see that for a second? Yep, no doubt about it. It's the insect cage. I thought so. Oh, ho, 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 good sir. You must be a master of jigsaw puzzles. This isn't the first time I've put together this particular puzzle. Hey, Rido, this is one of those insect cages that the 8th Fukoshi clan uses, isn't it? The cages that hold the luck lotists. Not those things again. They reared their ugly faces once more. And they found fragments of the cages at each of these murder scenes. That could only mean one of two things. One, the luck lotists are part of this. Or two, Don must have gotten out of his cage. And, I don't know, broke people's wooden insect cages. I don't fucking know. I thought the Tsukiyata business was over and done with. We'd better take a harder look into the connection between these killings and the 8th Fukoshi. Or, the Fukoshi. Alright, Raido. Time to roll up our sleeves and get investigating. Let's ask all the officers about what happened. We want the ones in white wearing the fancy hats. Let's ask them together, shall we? Why, yes. We shall. But first, I need to go buy some bird lime. I have a feeling that coming up soon we get like more insect cages. So bye. Give me some of that bird. Oh, we have six. Oh, we're good. Bye bye, fat old faggot. How many demons do I have? <coughs> that, ladies and gentlemen, was a sneeze. No oh, demons. I only have these guys, okay. Alright. I think with these guys I can make something. Let's go, uh... Demon fusing. Because I want to have as little, um... Random battle time in this session as possible. Because I just realized that it's the start of a new chapter. And I haven't fought the demon fiend yet. So... <laughs> you know, if I run into him accidentally, that's going to be like an entire freaking session. And I don't want that. I'm sure you guys don't want any of that either. Nibiros. Yeah, but then I have to get rid of Parvati. I don't want to get rid of Parvati because Parvati is amazing. 
And you're too strong for what? Gakudoshitoru Kokoko. Whatever the fuck you are. Trigloff. Fast talk. I think Trigloff is one of those special uh, demons that has like a weird um, talkings. Like, it, like, oh, fuck, what's a fucking word? Con weird conversations with other demons. Oh, look at that. Chucha Lane. Fuck you. Oh, you're not even worth my time. Uh, what can, what else can we make? Jirogumo, but don't really want to make one of those. You can get new way, but I have a new way. I can't make anything. Anything that I want. That I, oh, wait a second. Look at that. Nebiros. And you drain death. So, me thinks. Me, me thinks. Me thinks me wants a Nebiros. Let's see. What other things can we bring out to him? He should be good. Yeah. I'm fine with this. <laughs> me have new form soon, but heart's still mine. Wait and see, Summoner. San. That, was that Snailin's butt? Or a snake? Yes, yes, yes. You wanna fuck me. I, I understand. Oh, good thing you didn't fuck up this time, Victor. Or I would've been pissed. Fuck, I would've just restarted the entire load. So this guy. He is imperative to... I don't really know. However, I do know in the fourth Persona game, you fuse this guy and Belial, um, and you make Alice. Yeah, Alice. And the little, uh, girl demon thing. He nulls physical. That is so freaking useful. Wait. Luck Chakra. That's a life bonus. Endure is good. I guess anything force boost. Uh, that's all I need. No. Finders keepers, because we drain death. I mean, really? Do I need to drain anything else? <laughs> yeah, and all those are good. <sighs> A raga naja. And this thing, tentacle rape up the ass. And if you remember correctly, from the beginning of the game, we fought that thing. That is a really high attack. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Nothing else going for it but that attack. <laughs> Damn. Now, as I was saying, you fuse him and Belly all together to make uh, Alice Sue. And you see here, Alice is a special kind of demon because she has history in the Shin Megami Tensei world. She was taken care of by... Uh, Belial and Nebiros. So, in some ways, Belial and Nebiros are kind of like her father and uncle. You know, her surrogate protectors. I think Beck Young is maxed out. F fucking A. Thank you. Oh, Zandine and Null Electric. Well, you're close to the next level, so I guess I'll hold off for now. For training Nibiros. Until then, stuff. So, yeah. And, like, something that Alice does is she uh, asks the main character, like, will you play with me forever? Or, oh, etc., etc. And then eventually she'll, like, say something. She'll have her last request. Um, she'll ask you, would you die for me? And,. You know, die for me. That's your signature attack. And she, if you say, you know, yes or no, I think either way, she'll instigate a fight. And you have to beat her. And then you have the ability to recruit or summon or fuse Alice in, further in the future. <laughs> and she's apparently a really strong demon. And serial case with the blah blah blah, people are getting... People, wait, what? Poor steps ripped to shreds. Oh, wow. And after they're killed, 
Well, um, thank, uh, that was fantastic. Oh, what a great way to start off the weekend. No, I'm good, sir. Can I read your mind? No, apparently not. That's all you say. Okay. Let's move on to the rest of them. And, yeah. So, I'm probably gonna, like, because <laughs> in order to get Alice in this game, you have to beat the fiends, every single fiend within five minutes time. And, I, <laughs> for me, like, by this point, I should be able to beat the first one within five minutes, but, like, the last one would take maybe about ten if I was, you know, at the last chapter. And I have to kill, and I have to kill that thing. But then I also have to fight Alice, and I think she also has, like, a time limit. Get, wait, Manincho, Ginzacho, and Ichigama Gachi Ichicho? I don't know. Something about... Uh, stop. It's been case of nasty nasties. People getting ripped to shreds. I got that from the other one. I like how we, you know, emphasize that point. Okay, nothing. All I remember is that there's Manincho, Ginza Cho, and something else Cho. Ichia Cho. I don't know, but let's go to Manincho because that one is the closest. Wait, Rado, we're not done asking around yet. One at a time. Let's focus on what's happening in Tsukoto Joe. We want the officers in white wearing fancy hats. Let's ask them together, shall we? But I thought we did. I mean, he just gave us very important information. Oh. Oh, you. Yep, what? What is this? Something on the ground. Pick it up. Why, yes! Found wand tiles. What did I just get? One? No, no, that's not it. What the fuck did I get? One tiles. Oh wow, I have a lot of shit. A lot of amethysts, aquamarines, I got diamonds, some emeralds, some pearl. You know, that Pokemon stuff. Dog. Ah. Uh, no, seriously, what the fuck did I pick up? This is gonna kill me. I think it said wand screws or something like that. Wand tiles. I don't know if there's an officer behind here. Oh, hey, look at that. There's stuff on the ground. Empty mind. How did I ever pass that up? How have I never gone back there to get that? Like, that, that is like instinctual gamer logic to just go in the weirdest fucking places and get all the items you possibly can. How could I have possibly overlooked that little tiny bit? of land. You're not an officer. So fuck, if we looked through all that, then where the fuck is the last guy? Don't tell me he's creeping out behind this alley over here. Okay, good, he's not. How about in here? Possibly. Hey, creeper. Hey, creeper, creeper. Police, dude. You wanna come out wherever you are? Got your number. Oh, seriously. What? Oh, yeah, no, 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 that's right, that's, that's right, since we just got that, oh, running to walls, that's so uncouth. Um, since we have that information, we can go ask this dude, over here. Oh, detective work. So fine. Oh, good work back there, you're looking into the serial killings, right? I'll fill you on what I know. What do you need? Crime scene. I heard from the men posted at the other crime scene that they're getting reports of some kind of flying monster at each one. It sounds silly, but Manincho, Ginza Cho, and Harumi Cho. Okay, Harumi, that was the other one. Someone in each district saw this flying thing. There must be at least a grain of truth to it. Anything else? Good sir, there's this uh, flying monster you speak of. I find this highly illogical and somewhat profusely retarded. A flying monster, really? We're looking into it, of course, but it's probably a few lushes who got spooked by their own shadows. <sighs> Welcome to the 19... I want to say 70s here, when women were still considered, you know, frails. That's all I need to know. I'll go talk to your boyfriend back across the side... across town. 
it's weird.